All right, today we're going to be showing you how to install an IDE optical drive. These are the older versions that most people are using SATAs now, but we're going to go through this video first before the other. All right, first off, you have your optical drive here. It's a 40 pin IDE with a 4 pin power. You have a jumper here that you need to set. Uh, you have uh, your uh, audio plugs here. You got your tool free rails that go on the sides to hold it in. This particular model is a tool free so they just slide and snap in. And then you got your IDE cable and you can only run a single drive on this and your blue goes on your motherboard. Alright, first thing you want to unhook your power cord from your computer. Lay that out of the way. You want to open up your case so that you can access the insides of it to do all your connections. And you'll have to remove your front panel and they come off differently depending on how your case is designed. On this one they just pop right off. Slide that out of the way. You take your rails and you put one here. They snap right in. One here. It snaps in. You slide that in like so until you hear it click. Then you take this panel, put this panel back on here. And the installation part is done. Now you want to put your cable on. You hook your cable on your 40 pin and once again like we said before if you bend these you can straighten them but they're very hard to get to plug up once you bend them. Plug this in the back. It has a notch in the drive as well as the motherboard and these cables will only plug up one way. So if you have to force it, it it's not going in right. You got to plug your power connector up. Now you'll want to reinstall your power cord. Start the machine up. It almost they'll automatically detect. Anything running at least Windows XP, they'll automatically detect. On this one, we're going to go into the BIOS to see if it's detected because it doesn't have an operating system. As you can see in the BIOS, it's detected it. It's a lid on combo. It's a DVD ROM and a CD burner. And it's detected our hard drive. And that's how you install an IDE optical drive. 